my little manger and the paper towels because I didn't want my little sack getting off. Uh, of course, that's pretty, pretty nice and clean. <laughs> Those are so cool. I mean, so cool. So I'm going to get ready to fire it up Friday, as Dominic would say. I watched him this morning. Jeez, so peace. Hi, boy. He can get a fire started faster than I can even look. There's some wood chomped up here. Because, uh, I'm going to cook. I'm going to get me some lunch. I'm going to make some cheesy metwursts. So, we'll see how that goes. I'm going to use some of Howard's fat wood. I got some on here. Come back here. Don't be. It's kind of like chaga tea. You just don't go throwing it away all over the place, you know? <laughs> so this week, I want to say hello to a very special young lady. Uh, she gave me a really sweet uh, little shout out Sunday night on the Sunday Night Knife Show. And uh, that is Nevaeh. And um, Nevaeh, I am looking forward to seeing you as well, my dear, at the spring meet, Lord willing. Just keep on praying I'll be able to make it. And hey, I look forward to seeing you. And uh, Nevaeh did a knife review on Coyote 238's channel Sunday night. You need to go listen to this lady. This young lady give man, she does a knife review like nobody's business. I'll put a link to hear her um knife review on her knife she has in the description. I'm gonna fire this up with the little pocket size fire rod and striker. Nathan 4071 Ferro Rod and Striker that Dominic sent me. I mean, look at that lava come off there. Whoa! Come on. There we go. We're fired. We are fired. Get her in the manger. stick or two down in there. Put this on top of. There we go. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Throw us some other sticks on here. Get us a little fire going. Cause I'm hungry. It's lunchtime. There she goes. Tell you what, these old things are so durable. I have sure enjoyed it, Bruce. Thank you. The manger's from Fab Creations. In case y'all are wondering, I haven't forgot about the giveaway. Yep, nope, I haven't. Uh, stickers should be in, and we'll be doing it probably next week. That's the plan.
was going to do a video on this. This is my, it's actually a, a tin can. And you see that's the lid. I took it and cut it in half. Put the uh, lid on there so it don't come off. And that's going to be my little grill. Check that out. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? But anyway, I'm going to use this little grill over here so I can cook up my mantlers. are getting there. And we're cooking. Look at that. Whoops. Let me get it in frame. <laughs> Y'all want to see, don't you? We're cooking. Enough. Cooking. What do you think? Looking good. Got my got myself ready here. Got some stone ground mustard on there. Some greens, yeah. And good old pickles. I love me some pickles. Mmm. All right, y'all. They're done. Can you see? Can you see? Look at that goodness. Those dudes did excellent on that little stove. Look at there. Mm, time to enjoy. Thanks, Bruce. I can grill me up a little lunch. y'all happy fired up friday and by the way it was amazing how little it took to fire up to grill those those uh metwurst hardly any hardly any fuel at all so those stoves are fuel efficient for sure just thought i'd share that so you can see it really didn't Take much of my, my wood. You, you can see it didn't didn't take much of my little wood pile. And um, look at that. Hmm. Still got some embers. We could have cooked a couple more. All right. 